A 3,500-year-old Egyptian artwork in Luxor was being restored after a 15-year-old Chinese tourist scratched his name into it. The boy etched Mandarin calligraphy on the tablet of Alexander the Great, reading, Ding Jinhao was here. The vandalism sparked internet outrage after a microblogger who had visited the temple recently wrote about the defaced tablet and posted a picture. Ding Xinhao's parents have reportedly apologized to the Egyptian people and angered Chinese citizens. Chinese media has reported he defaced the temple several years ago. Egypt's once vibrant tourism industry has been in the doldrums in recent years after violence following the downfall of Hosni Mubarak, his replacement by an Islamist president, and massive and from time to time violent protests against rising prices and government corruption. About 10% of Egypt's GDP depends on tourism. It provides direct jobs for nearly 3 million people, critical income to more than 70 industries, and generates 20% of Egypt's foreign currency reserves. One of the world's greatest tourist destinations, Egypt has been heavily visited by Europeans for better than a century. In recent years, the wealthy Western tourists have stayed away more and more, prompting government efforts to attract replacement visitors from the Mideast, the former Soviet space, and Southeast Asia. Some Egyptians have complained that tourists from the wealthy Persian Gulf region seem to look down on Egypt, while visitors from Russia and its neighbors offend Islamic values with excessive drinking and skimpy bathing outfits, while Chinese tour groups, some Egyptians say, display insufficient respect for Egypt's ancient culture.